Hi Libra, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Uh, thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and get into this Libra. Thank you God for blessing Libra with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see what's going on for you this week, Libra. What's going on for Libra this week? The Magician, very nice. All right. And what is the advice for Libra this week? What's the advice? What's the advice for Libra this week? The Hermit. Okay, you got two majors coming out. And the outcome for Libra this week. What's the outcome here? The Ace of Cups. Okay, and at the bottom of the deck, the Seven of Pentacles. All right, so it looks like you've got some idea that you want to come into manifestation into fruition here. Um, you may be looking for answers outside of you, but the advice here is to listen to that inner voice, self-discovery uh, journey here. There's a transition or changing your personality here and your personal philosophy. You're, you're thinking about what has worked for you and what is not or what has not, has not been working for you and how you can shift that. You're looking at past experience. Have you been getting the outcome that you want? If you have not, then it's about shifting maybe your personal philosophy, your personality. Because you got some things that you want to bring into manifestation, into fruition here. And you're waiting for this, these things. Also, this could be for some of you, there could be somebody here who wants you. They want to bring you back. They want to have you. They, they're in love with you. Maybe you don't love them like they love you or vice versa. The seven of pentacles at the bottom of the, of the deck. This person could be really just stuck on you, pining over you, just can't get over you. Uh, waiting. It could be waiting in vain. They're taking a very passive approach to love. Uh, frustrated with how things are going, but they're not giving up and they feel like this is not the end. Could be you. Could be another person. Could be Gemini, Aquarius, Aries, Virgo, anybody. This could be how you feel also. The advice is to ask yourself, are you getting the outcomes that you're looking forward to? If you're not, then you need to shift something about you. Self-discovery journey. Wanting to change something, go in a new direction on a new journey here. Um, maybe even separate from something or someone. Or you already have, or this is what someone has done or is doing in terms of you. The Ace of Cups and the outcome. Um, maybe this is... be. This will be redefining yourself, your look, your personality, how the world looks at you. You're going to redefine something, remake, remodel something about you. Again, personality. You could be studying spirituality. If you're not studying spirituality right now, then your cup is just full with a lot of uh, good emotions for yourself. You feel good about yourself. You're letting love flow through you freely. This could, once again, be somebody loving someone who doesn't love them. It could be you or another person. I don't know. The Lord of the power of, of the Lord of the root of the power of waters. So, that, you know, water or emotions have a lot of power. You know, um, they can move you, move you to tears, move you to joy, move you to inspiration. You could be getting some downloads. Okay. Could have some psychic powers or trying to hone in on them or, or fine tune them. Very in, in, interesting week for you, Libra. Some of you could be pregnant or trying to get pregnant. Or somebody is pregnant. Yeah, pregnant. This is what I have for you. If it resonates, let me know. Let me pull a Kipper card for you. Kind of tie this in. What is this about for Libra? Somebody was trying to use all of their power to bring something into 
fruition here. Yeah. Okay. So a message, a letter, text message, email, something could be coming towards you. Okay. Somebody feels left out in the cold. Again, they feel like somebody's really stuck on you or vice versa. You're stuck on somebody. Could be a message coming to you here. One of love or likeness. Uh, it's good news. Okay. Um, that's what I have for you, Libra. If it resonates, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also go over to the website. Um, oh, I said that book your own reading. You could donate to the channel if you're feeling moved to do so by clicking the buy Ella coffee link. Catch me here every Tuesday, Thursday and Sunday night, 930 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Ask a question. Come for the collective reading. Drop down in the comment section, Libra, and let me know who is stuck on who is it you stuck on somebody or the other person stuck on you libra if this resonates for you let me know if you get a message in seven days seven weeks at the at most but seven days here and what is it about i know it's good news all right libra let me know take care bye